Hello. It's Blunty. I'm back uh, in Russian Fishing 4. We're, uh... It's now the day after. I caught that mirror ghost carp. Sorry, spoilers if you didn't watch the last episode of the... Um, you know, trophy series that I'm doing. But it definitely feels nice to have finally gotten that done. Uh, we're at 32.7k. We just put in a two-day ticket here in Norway. We're going to head back out to our 34. Um, you know, we always hope for a couple trophies, but obviously we're here for silver farming, and that's what this episode is. We're going to be using our Mega Perk again. Just if you don't know, this is plus 7% to Marine and plus 2 to Pilker Rigs, so we're getting basically the best bonus you can possibly get for the small areas that we're fishing in. Um, and yeah, I'm using my Goliath, locking at 80. Because this guy can handle 88, my Goliath can lock plenty there. Um, and we're, we're back on blue stuff, and we're gonna use the 107 and three seven five fives on blues, and we're gonna look for Sori. Sori are typically pretty good money, and there's a spot on VK, um, there's specifically a VK group called China Spot. And China Spot tags in Norway Sea had this spot that looked very good for Sori. Um, there is no cafe for them right now, but if there's a cafe, it's even better. Um, but yeah, we're going to see what we get out of here. Maybe a Sori trophy. I already have one, but uh, we'd be happy to take another one just for the silver at this point. Or a BT Sori that I could mount on a wall would be pretty cool. Um, you know, a BT story might be a medium, and we're not going to have room on the wall, so we may end up having to go a house, and I'm not opposed to doing that. But I don't know if I would want the Norway house or the quarry house, because the quarry house is only like 14 gold right now. So, you know, that's like 30 bucks. Anyway, who knows? It would be nice to have a house to display my stuff in. Okay, here we go. I'm going to get to fishing, and then I'm going to, as as we normally do, I'm going to have you join me when something's going on, or we'll do a check-in uh, some way through the fishing. So, yeah. Also, just in response, uh, somebody asked in the comments, and I suspect other people might be curious as well. Oh, we're also going to clip to 20 here. I'm sorry, I meant to say that. We're on the 34, we're clipping to 20. I mentioned this in the last video as well, but uh, we want to be sometimes doing this clipping thing and just catching everything in that middle layer on these low spots. Um, but I digress. Someone asked in a previous episode um, why I don't record everything and then edit so that, you know, like if I catch a mackerel trophy or something here, you know, I don't know what's coming, so I can't start it early. I can't unpause early. Um, part of the reason for that is a big part of my motivation for doing this style of video was that I don't have to do the editing. I do other YouTube content as well. And, um, you know, most of it is attempting to avoid heavy editing. So um I know some of you may think, oh, that's a great story to start with. I know some of you may think, hey, it's not that big a deal or whatever. You should just make better content. But yeah, I don't, I don't really care. So I hope you enjoy the content that I make. Um, and yeah, that's how it's going to go. Also, they asked about like dramatic music um, or like, you know, putting music beds behind things. And like, I don't, you know, if there was some huge demand for that, maybe I would do that. But I'm, I'm doing this to kind of have fun. Um, playing video games and also posting them. And if people enjoy it, that's great. It's not really meant to be like, how many subscribers can I get? Um, or anything like that. So we're not going to be doing things that are too baity. You know, the most clickbait things that I have any interest in doing are just like that thumbnail of the last um, trophy video I did, where it's just like, here's a question mark, and you'll find out what I caught in the video. You know what I mean? That's, that's the most I would like to do with that. So, Hope you guys are enjoying the channel um, and the way I'm making videos. 
uh, yeah. So like I said, I'll be back uh, when something's happening or to check in on our numbers and where we're at. Just to check in, um, we're actually doing pretty good for being overnight. You know, we're 17 fish in 13 minutes and it's just becoming morning and it's raining. So I think that bodes well for the spot. But I will continue to check in as we progress. All right, here's the check in. Uh, our total time here is now one hour seven, and we are at 81 fish. But you can see recently, the last like eight to 10 minutes, this night really dropped off versus the last one. It is not raining. But maybe raining was beneficial to us. Um, but just in case, I know nighttime sometimes the dark stuff can work well. Um, so I went ahead and switched to. Uh, I tacked on a black foam and a 6503 with the black beads. Just to see if we can get anything. We're going to drop that all the way down. So far, though, I think the other setup has been pretty good for Sori. So. Not sure. But we will see what happens, I guess, with this these uh, black lures on. It's kind of a Hail Mary. And the last time I was here, the 6503s are what I was using 3 of. See what that was on. That was on the 6503. <clears throat> I will do some more testing and I'll be back in a bit. I wonder if we got something of decent size now, probably on one of the black things that we have in. I'm gonna go and lock up and lift it on out. I've been trying to decide what I wanna get first. You know, if I go with the C setup, am I going to buy the heavy boat rod? Part of the problem is today, if you, I'm sure you've seen it by the time you'll see this, but there's a new trailer for the new map. And the new map is a cart map with bottom rods. So, like, should I actually just save my silver and then either buy the new rod reel that comes out or buy, you know, Vengas or something? We got bigger carp, maybe angrier carp, or maybe it'll be new carp rods with different limitations. Who knows? So, oh, that's that's the uh, we'll take that every day of the week. Nice. Those should probably be marked rare, right? Interesting. That was, yeah, that was on the black foam. So we don't mind that. All right, I'll be back. Also a place. I'm gonna guess let's see, is that on the it's on the lurker? Alright, we got our first actually big fish. I'm gonna lock up. I think he can pull pretty hard though, so we're gonna have to be careful. Low and steady. Maybe not, but he's very bouncy. It's like a little halibut, maybe? This could be like a turbot or something, huh? They always shock me how strong they are.
I'm so worried whatever it is is about to max out the bar. I don't want to miss. I want to miss it. Is that a beagle? No, that's a green. What is that? What? No, that's a basking. I've never caught one of these before. Oh my gosh. What was he doing out here? Excuse me, sir. It's a two meter fish. Get the heck out of here. Let's get back on the spot here. Jeez, how rude. Go home, sir. Let's see, what did we catch him on? Let's stop and then... The Lurker, oh boy. Well, uh, yeah, careful for that when you're out here, I guess. That's gotta be pretty rare to happen. I've never, I've, at least not has not happened to me before, so. All right. See you guys soon, I guess. All right, we're at the end of our ticket. We did two hours. Here's our net. We got 134 fish. I kept all the non-markers as well. Except for the last one, I think I tossed a sculpin. Uh, obviously, the only cool thing we really got was the basking. We kind of expected, uh, kind of expect to not make much money on that because those are pretty cheap. Our actual total is 1362, so not amazing. With the ticket removed from that, it's like, uh, what is that, 1170 or something like that? Uh, you can see, where's that basking at? Oh, it doesn't show up in here. That's right. 8713. I guess that's not as bad as I thought it was going to be because it came up pretty easy. So we'll just double check for cafes. Oh, we did end up with a sorry cafe. The 176. So that covers our boat ticket, basically. So 1300 is what we made because we'll take like 10 silver more off. Okay, not too bad. That's going to do it for me. I will see you guys next time. Peace out.